Assalamu alaikum viewers Today we will discuss about this invent method or quadratic formula With the help of discriminant method we can find out the roots of the quadratic equation First we have discussed about in the last topics uh, what we call that that is uh, called factorization method Now we have another method that is called discriminant method It is uh, very much convenient that uh, factorization method. It has 100% uh, 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 accurate uh, chances to find out the roots of any quadratic equation. D is equal to B square minus 4AC. It is called a discriminant. It is called a discriminant. With the help of this, I can solve this. First, we have to follow the steps for this quadratic equation. Step number one. I will compare this given quadratic equation uh, with the general form of the quadratic equation. And it may a comparison karunga, general form of quadratic equation. Se. General form of quadratic equation kya hai? ax square plus bx plus c is equal to zero. What's A? A is the quotient of x square. What's B? B is the quotient of x. And what's C? C is the constant term. The first step is A. A is here 4. B is equal to 4 under root 3. Any quotient of x that's 4 under root 3. And C is equal to C is equal to 3. Quotient is that it is a numerical quotient. X square, the numerical quotient of x square is 4, and the numerical quotient of x is that's 4 under root 3, and the constant term is 3. In the step 2, step number 2, now I will use the discriminant method that is d is equal to b square minus 4ac, which is denoted by a capital letter b. d is equal to b square minus 4ac. Now I will substitute the value of b square for a and c here. I will find out the discriminant. What is b square? b is 4 under root 3 and is 4 square. Minus minus 4 into a. What is the value of a? That is 4. And what is the value of c? That is 3. Now I will solve this. Square and square root, uh, root will go, but the square root of 4 is present. That means 4 square that is 16. And the square root of 3 cancels. That remains here remains only 3. Minus 4 4 is are 16, 16, 3 is are 48. Can we multiply these two? These three. 16 3 is are 48 minus 48 48 and minus 48 that means my discriminant comes out 0 now I will go here nature of roots if the discriminant is 0 roots are real and equal and is the if the discriminant is less than 0 uh, roots are real and distinct that means not equal and if, if the discriminant is less than uh, 0, then the roots are imaginary roots, then that means no roots are here. <clears throat> here discriminant comes out 0, that means roots are real and equal. Now we apply the quadratic formula. The quadratic formula is x is equal to minus b plus minus under root of, under root of d yeah, I mean, b square minus 4ac now i will write here d in short it will escape my time divided by 2a now substitute here values x is equal to minus b what is the value of b minus b that is 4 under root 4 under root 3 sin minus plus minus under root of d D, I have found it already, that's 0. Divide by 2 
to what is the value of a value of a in the given coordinate equation that is equal to 4 now i will substitute here now i will solve it for the x is equal to minus 4 under root 3 it will remain as it is plus minus 0 plus minus under root 0 that is under root 0 that is 0 divided by 4 to the 8 now i will solve here minus 4 x is equal to minus 4 under root 3 divided by 8 plus minus sorry plus minus divided by 8 <coughs> that is x is equal to 4 1s are 4 4 2s are 8 that means x is equal to minus 1 plus minus under root 3 sorry sorry यहाँ पे एक मिस्टेक हो गई। That means x is equal to minus four minus four under root three. When we add plus, it will not affect the original uh, original number. And when we subtract minus zero, it will not affect affect it. That means plus zero or minus zero. It will not affect the given number divided by 8. It remains as it is. Now here we will divide 4 1s are 4, 4 2s are 8. That means x is equal to minus under root 3 divided by 2. And sign is minus. That means it has two equal roots. That is x is equal to minus under root 3 by 2. That means same roots. Because the discriminant is 0, its roots are equal. That means it is both the roots are minus under root 3 by 2. I hope you will understand it well. It's clear.